Hello viewers, a very happy weekend and a very happy friendship weekend to all of you out there. Welcome to Ella's Eat Bits. Today's episode is a very special one. I'm here celebrating more than 30 years of friendship of one of my dearest friends, Shipra Guho. She is here in Asansol meeting her childhood friend, uh, Vijaya, and the beautiful bond they share. I can't say I'm not a little jealous, but yes, it's great to be with them. Be with me, stay with me right after the music. <music> Okay. Hi, Vijay and Shipra. How is it going? And uh, how are you spending time with each other? Can you tell me a little more about the relationship uh, you share? It's great to be with Shipra. She is a down-to-earth friend. I have known her since my childhood days. Uh, we were together right from KG1 in Mount Carmel, Convent, Rorkela. And after that... We moved on to other classes and then our friendship started cementing day by day, year by year. And uh, I'm really blessed to have a friend like a Shipra. Hope everyone gets a friend like her. Okay, Shipra, what do you have to say? I have to say the same things as she has told. We are friends since nursery and still we are having the same friendship and we are blessed that both of us are married in Bengal so that we can frequently meet and uh, I am blessed to have her as my friend. Would you like to say something to this generation where they find it very difficult to even make friends? Uh, of course, uh, today we find or we see that uh, children are more uh, glued to mobile and other uh, devices uh, but I feel that they too must have friends and uh, establish uh, their friendship uh, so that it's a friend who will always be there with them till uh, the end. Uh, you both have... Times and also in your favorable times. Uh, you both have had family res responsibilities, children growing up, jobs. Uh, uh, in the you know uh, yesteryears and still you maintained this relationship can you share a few tips about that I, it's only because of our love uh, our understanding that has uh, bounded us together and uh, we though we faced several ups and downs in life several thorns on our way you know life is not a bed of roses there are also thorns but this love and the affection that we uh, got, uh, that has actually paved our way towards success and happiness. We have been missing every time each other when we are far away. So we have always found a route to meet the, each other. So we met also and we And I am really happy that even at this age, at the age of 65, yeah. we never feel that we have grown up. Even mentally today, we are in our teens. Okay. We are not 65, we are 63. <laughs> <laughs> no, so I, I believe Vijay is as bad as me uh, in maths. In maths, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. She's so <laughs> excited that she wants to say so many years of friendship. Now she's also in the years. I'm extending the years. <laughs> doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. But extending the years is not the problem, but extending the age is a problem. <laughs> <laughs> so friends you just saw the magical relationship that these two people have and uh, on that note we are celebrating this weekend together and i would like to share a new recipe orange paneer vijaya is a vegetarian so in her kitchen today at asansol sugam park welcome to the kitchen vijaya's kitchen with ella's eat bits like i said orange paneer so we'll need some fresh oranges some paneer a spoonful of uh, corn starch or you can use maida if you want today i'm going to use flour atta right it's as simple as that five minutes and it is done let's see how it goes juicy tasty tangy sweet a uh, combination of flavors the sweetness of oranges and 
When they enter the chunks of paneer, they leave a mouth-watering dish that you must, must try. The ingredients are as simple as always. I have extracted the juice of three and a half oranges. The paneer has been cut into pieces. Half the orange I have taken out and left for decorating. The pepper and chili powder, the orange juice is here. And the sugar and salt, the onion I have peeled. So half the maida will go into the paneer pieces. Vijaya could finally manage to find some maida. The oil is warm. The paneer pieces will go into the oil along with the onion uh, onion pieces, right? And I will toss this a little so that they change a little color. They should become a little golden. Uh, the rest of the maida, I will add some orange juice and nicely dilute it so they become, um, you know, lumpless. I will add that to the rest of the juice. Now the orange juice is ready to go into the paneer and onion uh, pieces. And this is almost done. Here I will add the salt and the pepper and chilli powder. This is optional. You can add as much uh, chilli powder. You can add less. You can add more. But because this is a sweet, sweet, a uh, sweet tasting dish, it should not be very high on uh, spices, right? Uh, the, I have added a little sugar also so that the sweetness of the paneer remains and with the orange juice they become less tangy. Uh, though the oranges are very sweet here, there were four large oranges. The orange juice goes in. I will cook this till the um, you know paneer has uh, soaked in enough of the orange juice to make it nice and juicy. I don't want it to be rubbery so I won't cook it too much. On a medium flame I will let it boil and cook. See it is turning a little uh, thick already. This will be eaten with steamed rice so I don't want it to be very dry also right. The, it is almost done and here go in the decoration special to me as we are celebrating the friendship of Vijaya and Shipra. I am also celebrating etching Ella's name in my arm as she is etched in my heart. How do you like it viewers? This was done here at Galaxy Mall Asansol. So I will hold this trip very very dear to me. If you like the tattoo of Infinity Ella and her smile in it, just leave a comment saying wow in the box below. And that is the tattoo studio where I got it done. And here is the artist Sagar. He said I was the youngest customer they had had. And as he etches the name and Shipra does the shooting. Here is Jeet the designer. And it was great posing with them and just a decision of a moment. Back to the recipe. Juicy, orange, flavorful, tasty, tangy, um, delicious orange is ready to be served with steamed rice. I'm sure that looks tempting enough. What say? So viewers, I hope that was a quick, easy, simple recipe. And would you agree with me when I say happy friendship week to Vijaya and her friend Shipra and cheers to friendship. I hope all of you out there get good friends and preserve that relationship forever and ever. There's nothing as valuable and precious as friendship. friendship really. <laughs> तेरा साथ ना छोड़ेंगे ये दोस्ती अब नहीं छोड़ेंगे सो दैट्स विजया एंड शिप्रा सिंस स्कूल डेज दिस इज शिप्रा एंड विजया नाउ एंड सी हियर एट द गैलेक्सी मॉल योर्स क्यूटली एंड आई कूडंट स्टॉप माय सेल्फ फ्रॉम क्लिकिंग इट सो ऑन दैट नोट बाय फ्रेंड